what's up everybody welcome to another b3 community hangout got the stream yard link posted so if you want to hop on just hop on how's everybody doing today happy new comic book day get to the chat real quick what's up tina babe happy wednesday i hope you're doing well today have the day off las cruces what's up bud thanks for coming through White Tiger, what's up, Ruby? Cowabunga, Shinobis. Love it. Wahoo! What's up, DJ? Trying to jump on last 30 minutes. That's cool. You can get on, you can get on. Appreciate you. Christina, what's up, Christina? Thanks for coming through. Appreciate you. D, what's up, D? Black number seven, appreciate you. Glad to see you're back, at least impartial. Hope you're feeling better. Monch, what's going on, Monch? Thanks for coming through, buddy. Been using that Monch art in my Demon Slayer shorts in the background there. Just amazing. All good. Well, thank you so much. Appreciate that, D. Need to get a need to get Sasuke from you, Monch. Very determined. Yes. Gonna be going through my Batman Superman World's Finest boxes. Switching out some bags and boards. What's up, Will? Be in a little bit. You're welcome anytime. What's up, Mike? Working and lurking. Thanks for popping in. Bulldog, what's up, Bulldog? Hope you're doing well. Haven't seen you in a bit. Giving gang, baby. Love seeing them giving gang members in here. Meatwad, what's up, Meatwad? Appreciate you. I didn't even look to see. Do you have a you have a channel, Meatwad? I need to check that out. Yep, Tina's. <laughs> um, no. <laughs> Thanks, everybody, for coming through. Appreciate you. A few things I can show off. I saw this for $1.50 at Walmart. G Fuel. But it's got Sage Mode Naruto on there. So I had to grab that. Put that in the case. Not open it. Just saw that at the grocery store today. Wally World. Just a supporter. All good, all good. Just wanted to make sure I wasn't missing any content. Go support you a little bit. What's up, cat fan? Hope you're doing well. Sorry I missed this morning. I need to go back and check it out. But I had a bad morning. Things are not going my way. Right? I mean, for a dollar fifty. Might as well. Anyway. And uh, I actually got this in the mail the other day. And I totally forgot that I wanted about three weeks ago on In The Mix, DJ Links, Friday nights. But I won this Power Girl foil 9.8. Ooh. Man, this shit's all fucked up now. Damn it. Put it too close. There we go. What in focus? Sorry about that. Hell yeah. What's up, Robert? Thanks for coming through. Say one day, Tina. <laughs> Thanks, babe. Appreciate that. Pretty awesome. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I've been on a roll lately. 
Nobody else is popping on, so it's going to be me. Let's do these. First off, we have JP's Budget Collecting. I actually thought I was subscribed to this guy. He's usually on John's Comics with Kids and a couple other different channels, but he does a couple awesome weekly um, trash or hot comics if they're good investments or not. And he goes back like six months later on hot comics that are on top 10 lists that are popping off and seeing if they're still hot. So a lot of useful information. One of some great, great videos. He does some shorts as well, just going over some issues. Comic Cap, what's up, Rich? Thanks for coming through. Gary, Gary Woods, appreciate you, bud. Next we have, so check out JP's Budget Collecting. I think he does a uh, uh, Tuesday, Tuesday evening show is whenever he goes live. Check that out. Like I said, thought I was following him, but... Next, we have, I was following this girl on Instagram, huge Funko Pop collector, anime mainly, got all the Naruto Pops, but uh, she has a YouTube channel. She's doing a pretty good giveaway over on Instagram right now, so check out Odo Funko Pops, just a Funko Pop collector, if you're into that. Chris, what's up, Chris? Thanks for coming through. Saw you dropped another video today. Appreciate you. Hope you're having a great day, great week. Let me know what y'all picked up for New Comic Book Day. If you read anything or if you just picked up a haul you want to talk about. It was a massive week for me. And lastly, we have Four Color Commentary. It's got 725. I guess I didn't go over the last subs, but 725 is what he has. He's uh, going over the Atlas Seaboard um, comics line, I guess. All the different comics that came out during that time from that company. And then he also goes and on his shorts does comics. Just little short walkthroughs on a few pages of different comics. Got the Hulk versus Juggernaut here. But go check out Four Color Commentary. What's up, Birdman? Thanks for coming through. Cobra Commander was awesome. Nice. Can't wait to read that one. What's up, AR? Star Trek 19 so far. It was awesome. Nice. Nice. What universe is that in? Is that a... Like, next generation or anything in particular? Is it its own thing? So, like I said, I'm just grabbing these boxes, starting with my PC collections, changing out some bags and boards that have been on there for 20 plus years. What's up? Oh, damn, it jumped on me. What's up, First Phil? The Squirrel Scribe. Thanks for coming through, Phil. I had to pick Giant Size Hulk, Avengers Twilight. I actually got Avengers Twilight number one, the third print. So I have one through five now. I can actually read it. Really pumped about that. And Giant Size Hulk. Is that people were saying that's like a $10 book or something? Nine or $10 book? They're like, damn it, these annuals. But you got to get it if you're reading it, I guess. Hey, what's up, Eddie? Eddie from the Bat Cave. Thanks for coming through. Just watched your video earlier. All those Marvel two and ones. Really awesome. Awesome Neil Adams Justice League as well. And Chop and drop. What's up, buddy? Guess I missed you up here. Thanks for popping in, Chopster. Legend. So these first few I actually having clear bag and boards. Might as well show them. We got the boom. Hey, yes. What's up? Oh, he's at the LCS. 
Yes. Yes, I am. I'm in my store right now getting my books. Nice. I'm to pop on real quick here, see what's what. I don't think I can flip the camera around, though. I don't know if there's an option for that on here. I have option to turn the camera off. I think that's it. So yeah, mine's to... the same. Is that an iPhone? No, it's an Android. Oh, I don't know about Android. I know you can't do that on iPhones. I don't know. Man, are, the titles, wall, wall are the titles forward on behind me, or are they backwards? Can you read um... them? They're forward. Okay. All right. There yeah, is so, an option, he said. Is there? There is oh, an well. option. What's up, Canadian one. survivalist? Anyway, I've got a stack of books here. Nice. And i got to walk around here and see what's what. Because, you know, this it's not a big store. You know, this is like the main aisleway here. You got all the new books here, and then there's drawers full of old stuff here. Oh, those that's awesome. So you they just wow, that's floor. a really nice store. Actually, it is a nice setup. It was a cool I've never setup. Never seen that like before. It. No, neither have I with the drawers. I mean, some of them they gotta put like a piece of paper to hold them shut or they'll just fly open on you. <laughs> but but yeah, it makes it super easy to go flipping through back issues. So Wow. Not that I do that a whole lot. I'm mostly after the new stuff in here. You you buy all that all those old issues from Texas. Yes, that's right. They got to come from Texas or nowhere else, man. <laughs> <laughs> Arlington, Texas. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> got to got to say it with that accent, Canadian <laughs> uh, Canadian Texan accent. <laughs> Good day, eh? Yes, sir, eh? Eh? <laughs> <laughs> so, did you get any good books? Oh, yeah. I got a buttload of books. A buttload. Including this baby right here. Oh, yeah. That's the... Uh, is that first Jubilee? Yes, sir. Yes, it is. 220-something. 244. 244. Okay, yeah. 221 Sinister, 244's Jubilee. And yes. 266 is allegedly second, first gambit. You can start a fight with that one. <laughs> Wasn't there... Um, uh, we we all know which one looks better. That's all that matters. Well, yeah. The first, the full, you know. And what the intention was. Because if you talk to the, the writer, he, he intended 266 to come out first. So that was right. just a screw up. See, I'm even sporting... Got to represent the LCS too, right? Nice. That's pretty dope. That's the one that they gave you, huh? Yeah. Yeah. There was supposed to be a foil edition of a DC book today too. Wasn't it supposed to be Crisis? Yeah, Crisis. Crisis one. one. Mm -hmm. I don't see it here. It's probably like thirteen dollars or something like that, or twenty bucks or something. <laughs> no. Because it's made out of foil, so you know it's more expensive. I think those are usually eight bucks. Yeah, but holy crap, man. Stuff is... Gary Woods is talking about annual Hulk, annual $10. Yeah, I picked up that one. I got a healthy yeah. stack. Cobra Commander's out today. Yeah, I can't wait to read that. Somebody said they read it. It was good. It's set in the Prime Universe. Cisco has left the wormhole and is having adventures with the Trek team. Hilarious and Voyager. Oh, wow. That's six ninety nine so for that agglomeration. That's awesome. What now? Six ninety nine for the giant size Hulk. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh wow! Well, yeah, yeah, oh, seven dollars and then tax, so it'll be like eight bucks something. Maybe yeah. he's talking about the a variant. What's up, Berdazzle? Right, very organized. Yeah, that's a beautiful setup. I love this. Makes life real easy when you're coming in here to look through stuff. Mm -hmm. So if you guys are in Oshawa, come to Worlds Collide. Great service, fantastic books, and you get some, there's some cool old stuff here too. You got to get yeah. some of that obsidian whenever you travel beyond the wall though. Yeah, that's right. You gotta make they'll, sure let you, they'll, they'll let you over the wall. We got dragons and shit that are patrolling back and forth over the wall there. <laughs> some of them are dead too, so you got to be careful. 
What's up, Sydney cat? <laughs> PSN. What's up, buddy? Ah, uh, it's rough. Feel for you. Hope you're doing okay besides that, though, PSN. What's going on with him? Uh, just jobless right now, looking for a job. Ah, shit, yeah, that is that is a problem. But take heart, there's always something out there. Yeah, might not be what you want, but it's something. Yeah, you know, what, you know what, whatever you're willing to do. Mm-hmm. God, they still got Savage Sword of Conan books here, too. All kinds of them. Just the, the magazine That's format? or the? Oh, no, that one. Yeah, it's the new one. Jesus, this camera. Figure this stupid thing out. Lots of uh, yeah. these big issues of uh, books that are like magazine size, and then they got those DC ones that are like a deluxe size, too. Mm-hmm. Prestige format or whatever. That's the word, prestige format. All right, now I got to dig through the free books, too. You told me I'm allowed to have more than one. Heck yeah, dude. <laughs> so I start digging all the time in here for these. They got this thing right here. So one free with a $20 purchase. But I spend more than that, so I'm going to take more than one. Yeah, you spend like 100 so you should get five. Shh, don't tell my wife. <laughs> might be listening. <laughs> I told her it's under 50. <laughs> That's that's well, kind of my. Uh, I try to keep it under. I was over that this week though. No, yeah, I never get. I never get under that. Sometimes I do. A nice new burn. A whole lot of good stuff. You got the Justice League versus Avengers wrap around. Oh yeah, there we go. Ooh, Saga Free. number one. Free. No, oh, fifty-five. Oh. It's the same look as number one. Like all the reading. Is it? Yeah, them just staying in there. Okay. Like as a, yeah. a pose, I think. Yeah. What else we got? Best battle scene. Avengers versus Justice League. Never ends. I mean, the most characters on the page right there. Holy crap, look at that one. That's nice. <laughs> you can wrap around. Five years. Great British bump off. And my favorite cover of those. Boom suits. Holy cow, yeah. Two. Both worlds. What's up, Durs? I Appreciate don't. you, bud. Hey, what's up, Troy? Hope you're having a good day. What else? Anybody else pick up anything cool? And we're getting in on these Batman and Superman. So, like right. 2003, 2004. So, they haven't been changed since then. We need a new bag and board. Bag looking kind of cloudy. God, it looks like one of the ones from the eighties, nineteen eighties bags. All right. Yeah, try not to get to that point where you pull the the comic off the board. It's leave a little yeah. bit behind. Leave all the paint behind. Yeah, <laughs> that's happened to a, a few of my books when I was going through my whole collection and I was rebagging everything. Some of the plastic bags were right from the 80s and they were so bad that I actually had to cut them open because they were like welded shut. <laughs> the plastic had actually melted and they were, yeah, it was that thick plastic too that just ate away. And uh -huh. the same thing, yeah, what you were saying, I pulled the backing boards off of them and the freaking uh, paint was coming off the back of the book. Like the imprint of the back of the book was on the backing board. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ripping packs for you. Thanks for coming through, Jonathan. That's issue one of Rogue Son. Got a variant. E cover, E cover. Okay. Kids collecting with Brody. Thanks for coming through. Have not seen your name before. Appreciate you stopping by. Nightwing did a nice dedication to Marvel Wolfman and Perez. Forgot to mention it. Nice. 
Yeah, I got to yeah. rearrange some of my books on my shelf too when I get home. That uh, Jeff uh, Verge, Verge, was that his name? Verge? I keep getting his name wrong. Guy who did a lot of the um, um, the Aboriginal type of artwork. He did a whole bunch of uh, Spider Man, Hulk. He did really cool artwork on all these books. He passed away from lupus. I think it was last mm -hmm. week or the week before. So I've been trying to dig out all his books so I can put it up kind of like a tribute. Nice. He did some really cool stuff, though. Caught you while at work. Appreciate you ripping, Jonathan. Hope everyone is well. Yeah, hope you're well. Some would say ice cream. Yeah, I think Tina's eating some ice cream. Picked up Swamp Thing 9, 12, and 19. Nice. From the original run or? That's cool. Swamp Thing's a favorite around here from a lot of people in chat. I think, I think Swamp Thing and Man Thing are both pretty popular. Yeah. Thanks, Brody. Appreciate you. Never really checked out the... Uh, yeah, but I... Uh, there you go. Trade, the trade paperbacks. Got a bunch of them. Oh, man. Got a gazillion. Man, the one that I want right now is the uh, Woman of Tomorrow. I need to get that. Supergirl. Okay. Everybody just praises that big time. I and mean, that's what they're going to uh, adapt the, the movie into. That's cool. Mmm, ice cream. You're that kid that's walking through the parking lot and you see another kid with an ice cream and you want an ice cream? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where to go, Tina? Everybody's like, I gotta get some ice cream now. Any other completionists out there that are by a major key you're missing in your run just to get home and realize it's on your wall? <laughs> <laughs> Been there, done that. <laughs> I can't say that I've ever done that, but I understand. I mean, you have a lot of books. That's why you have lists. Right, Tina? Get a list. You have a list, right. and you can't go wrong with the list. <laughs> all right. I think I've done enough damage in here. I'm going to jump off and uh, go pay for all this stuff. Cool, cool. Appreciate you stopping well, by. Yeah, when I get home and set up, uh, if you're still running, I'll pop back on, show you the hall. All right, cool. All right, see, we'll see you guys. The original run, heck yeah. Awesome, awesome. Troll was his last, I believe. Okay. What's up, Kyle? Thanks for coming through, my dynasty brother. What's up, Ozzy? This dude's got an awesome Instagram. Always doing awesome sales on whatnot. Check out Comic Aussie if you're looking for some keys. Vintage keys. Nice. You're in the right spot. You got a lot of people that love Bertie Wrightson. In the chat. Gore Shriek. Huh. Don't know that one. Awesome. T Roy, yeah. I think it's pretty funny when he says that. It's T Roy. Well, time for ice cream. Tina needs to work for a ice cream company, some Baskin Robbins or something. Tales from the Crypt, I believe so. Yeah, I believe Tales from the Crypt did. There you go. EC Golden Age. About to say, I'm pretty sure I've seen those. EC coming back is going to be really cool. Another comic company. The whole nother that specializes in in that. Yeah, if anybody needs a link, Tino will throw it down. You lost your ass. Oh, I'm sorry, Kyle. Tough to hear. 
All good, Mike. Taking the week off from reading the Dark Tower series. That's been hella fun. Doing that Saturday nights, every other Saturday on Evil's Comics channel. Something different. Never really read a book and been on a panel discussing the book. Pretty dope. Yeah, I bet they're pricey. They're EC horror. Tails even has a newer release. There you go. There's a newer one. Found Shock and Suspense Stories 4. One from the Comic Authority Code Nonsense. Half is, hey! Yeah, that's still a nice find. Even with partial cover. To a blue or orange. This is orange. What do you mean? What do you mean? What's up, Andy? Thanks for coming through. Really liked your free comic book day video. Going over all the books on free comic book day. We brief, briefly went over them on uh, one of my live streams, but you went really in detail. Awesome. Bunch of cool free comic book day books this year, seems to me. Got some good artists on them. 90s EC reprints. Nice, nice. Yeah. No, that's orange. Burnt orange. You can see the red behind me on the KC flag. All right. Where have we got so far? I love this run. One of my favorite all-time runs. Public Enemies is one through, I want to say like eight. Oh, that's four. Two. That's four. I'm blind. That's two. They're on the run and... President Luther is getting everybody to go after him. Heroes and villains. It's just awesome seeing Batman and Superman. Their team up. How they work off each other. Fight off each other. Can pretty much read each other's minds by, by this point. Cream Sickle. That one in the second second uh volume of this series with the Supergirl. Um, oh, God. What's that called? The second run. It's the Apocalypse movie. With Darkseid and, she, and he comes and corrupts the Supergirl. Those, both those animated movies were amazing. It's like the first two arcs of this series. Oh, definitely. World's Finest, baby. Yep. Animated movie was great. Gonna have to all of you on the TV watching you so I can do my daily show. Check out Cat Fans Daily Show in the morning, 8 o'clock Central Time. Comic and collectible. Goes through a collectible and a comic that's related to that. And he reads the comic. Pretty awesome. Does a lot of sound effects. Puts a lot of time and energy into that, so check that out. Yeah, thankfully shorts have really kicked ass. I have a short that's about 150,000 right now. It's gone viral. But it's just a number. I'm glad everybody comes around. These lives are what I do this for. I just love ripping packs, so one of those things to do on the shorts. Hey, what's up, Will? How come I didn't hear you pop in? They usually do this little ding or something. What up, Trev? What up, buddy? <clears throat> it's Austin. But um, just how long were you on last night? What time did I go? Uh, I went like ten something to like one something. There, no, it wasn't even that long. I don't remember. 
Um, no, I went to the comic shop and I'm definitely short some boards and backs, but I'm bagging and boarding too. So nice. I got yeah. a few comics I'm gonna send you. I'm making you a little pile. Oh, appreciate that. Yeah, so we're bagging this Merc with a mouth. Oh, nice. Yeah, I know we're both DC guys, but there's some Marvel. I like Spider Gwen. I like. Yeah. Yeah, I just have to keep the feud alive. That's why I always say that DC right. for life, baby. But I like a lot of Marvel. Yeah, there, there were, there were some books I could have picked up, but I didn't. I don't know. I may go back in a few days because I do need definitely more. Twenty-seven, baby. You know, Tina. What the heck? Why isn't it closing? What's up, Biz? I'll definitely have Thanks to get some through. tea. Let me get some tea. Will in the house. Hey, thanks, Kyle. I try to be. You try to, like, put out into the world what you want everybody to give you back. That's my motto. So I try to just put the positivity out there. Karma, man. It's all about karma. Nice. Got a cat fan, another subscriber. It's, it's pretty great. Like a little 12, 12 to 15 minute premieres in the morning kind of get you up and something to listen to while you're getting ready or like me when i take a my first break at work it's something nice just to watch what's up eddie what's up rats rats up, okay Thanks and then we're gonna bag you. this one spider gwen so oh, nice a spider gwen i won that from sith there's a handful of books i won from sith i need to bag board that might be a Walmart variant. Yeah, it's a variant. It's a cool one. Yeah. <laughs> Tina didn't like giving her link, her links because she doesn't do anything. She's An like, old Why? Avengers. There's no book. reason. I love that one. That's so good. Well, what number is that? I'm sorry. What number is that? One forty-six. Oh, okay. It looks like it'd be like an anniversary issue or something because. The picture, just the epic. Dude, group, yeah. Group Next shot. time I go to the shop, I'll be there longer. I was just, I was out with my buddy because um, we have a high school graduation next week, and we have um, we want to give our principal a gift, so we decided to get a one of those cool like mini helmets of Ohio State, as opposed to the silver. It's like the black with the red stripe. Uh huh. So it's like a flash mini helmet. Yeah. So we're gonna uh -huh. surprise him with that. And we got the dawn of DC free comic book day. I, I don't know if I'll make free comic book day this year because I don't know my work schedule yet. Which I'm sure you can go day. after and they'll still have some. Oh, I don't know. It just depends what time I work. They usually don't, you know, give they don't all sell. No, no way yeah. in heck. They had like $1, $2 boxes on the floor at the LCSA. I went through those. Those were... Eh, there was a really cool super uh, Batman cover. I wanted to get a slab of, but I don't know. I may go back for it. You see your favorite? Yeah, I don't even have a slab. I want to get a Batman slab eventually. Like an art, um, a detective's slab of him. Then we got this other Spider Gwen. I actually had to tape it because my friend gave it to me and it ripped a little bit on the bottom. But nice. Yeah, Spider Gwen number one, actually. Number one. I think it's her second volume. Yeah. Maybe. And then probably my second favorite Avengers cover. I have only have two Avengers books. I'm probably gonna pick or is first comic book I picked up by myself. Ooh, number forty four. Heck yeah. Yeah, look how bad condition it is though. Hey, it's still cool though. Yeah. Would you get it for a dollar? I think it's like 10 bucks. Oh, ten, yeah. Yeah, the back's torn up. The, everything's torn up about it. Just the cover, it seems like. That's why I bought it. Robin. Robin with her new picture. Hey, Robin. <laughs> What's up, Robin? Yeah, I'm, t tomorrow I don't work either. So tomorrow, literally, I'm going to do nothing. Like today... I wanted to do nothing, and then I wanted to do this thing real quick, and then 
Tomorrow's Nothing, and then another free comic book day. I'm not a huge fan of High Republic, but you know what? It's a comic in my collection. It's good. Back yeah. and forth. Yeah, I'm, I'm, yeah, there's some bags and boards I'm missing, so I'll have to definitely go back. There's some comics I definitely, uh, I think there's like four more books I need to bag and board after these. Uh, Black Magic, I'm not reading it because it's... Ginny Frizen, like, baby. Ginny I Fri love that character. Actually, yeah, it is Frizen. Um, I didn't read it because I just never got into the story, really. Maybe I'll pick it up eventually. It looks interesting. I won this from Seth. I won a handful of books. It's on my channel of what I won from him. I just like the cover. It's pretty cool. Heck yeah. Love Frizzin. Yeah, Getting like a meter at Heroes Con. What's up, oh, K-pop? Oh, dude, maybe I'll get her to sign that one day. Yeah. I, I'm sure she'll know. be back the next year. Maybe gold. I don't know what color. I think it's something. Yeah, I don't know. Do they have... I don't even know about all that. If they have like multiple colors and you get to choose or if they just have one color to sign it in or what and then this avengers free comic book day book i don't even do you know who that is it's cyclops yeah he's uh he, he takes on like a a different persona that's right i forgot i forgot what he calls himself but i'm pretty sure that's cyclops and he calls himself something let me see I wonder if he says it in the book yeah, Anybody that reading so. X-Men that would know? That's Uncanny Avengers, but pretty sure that was Cyclops. Great job. Yeah. Neil on Robin's new logo. It says Captain Krakoa. Right. My, my brother has the same thing. He always sends little images of himself as the cartoon character in that style. Hmm. And then I have other bugs and ports. I need to do it eventually. Your own Sharpie? Oh, okay. So just maybe bring some colored markers or something? Maybe I will. Yeah. But yeah, I de I'm, I'm going to take these down later or whenever. Oh, I hope the comics Paul's sending me are in bags and boards because then I'll have to bag and board again. If oh, okay. yeah. Almost guaranteed they're going to be in bags. I bet and they are. Yeah. I don't think Paul would send them without them. Yeah, Eating Taco Bell and chilling. Nice. Nice. Yeah, today's plan is chill. Captain Krakoa was was that him? Is that was that his name? I forget. Um, that sound that, that sounds like it might be right. I yeah, vaguely remember cool. I read like the first eight or nine issues of that run. And one of the variants has just, him. I just got this one because it was a free comic book day. I you know what's funny? People are like, yeah, you get to pick and choose a free comic book day. They just gave me a stack and they're like, here you go. <laughs> thanks for coming. Man. I was like, oh, okay, thanks. He said, poor Cyclops, nothing. He got two women's. Yep, yeah, but I'm done bagging and boarding. You can put it on yourself. Nice, nice. Yep. Yeah, I definitely have to get more bags and boards near me. I'm missing number six somewhere. Kind of for what? This. Uh, number five. You know what? I saw a few of those, and I saw one with um, who was it? Supergirl or Superwoman, where she's in the air like this. Yeah. I was thinking about getting that one. Yeah. That's a good one. I still want the freaking Power Girl with, with the jets in the back. Still want that <laughs> cover, dude. The jet cover. I want one. If anybody stumbles on a second one, I'll buy it. This is when I when I got back into reading after I got married. Covers? Sold almost all my collection. Is that a sketch co cover? Yeah, yeah. Someone sketched it for you? No, it's a it's a sketch. Like it's that cover, but it's just the sketch of the cover without color. Gotcha. So it's not a it's not a one of one. Are you gonna get a sketch cover done at Heroes? Yeah, I'm looking at a couple different ones. I haven't you think decided. It's Superman or Afra? Yeah. Yeah, probably. Made a run to the border. Ding. 
<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I have to leave. My grandson is too quiet. Need to check on him. Have a good night. <laughs> that was a nice, uh, that's a nice announcement. Thanks, Eddie. Have a good one, bud. It's funny. Everyone it's funny. on aisle five. I think DJ child. Wise was trying to jump in before you ended today. Ended? Your stream, my man. I bet he'll jump in. James? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's what he said. He said he'll try to. That's cool. Going to South Park. Hulk, man. I had a lot of Hulk. Let's go ahead and do this. Are we doing the randomizer again? Hashtag Gambit for, for a duck. duck for the April giveaway. I swear it's that was part of your chat. I mean, I can tell you what I like, but you just kind of have to see what you like and go from there, look up some different artists. I mean, Dan, I like Dan Mora, Jim Lee. Michael Turner, Alex Ross, Jenny Frism, Adam Hughes, um, Art Adams is good. Uh oh, you popped out for a second, huh? Yeah, I was trying to connect to the chat. I don't know where it was, but, but I'm not worried. I'll do it next time I'm on. Lee Bermejo, um, Lucio Perillo. There's tons and tons of good artists. Just got to kind of look through a bunch of comics until you find something you like and then look at that artist's other work. Yeah, That's I wonder who the artist. most common artist I have is. I'll have to look someday. Canadian Survivalist? I don't know if I missed you earlier. No, I highlighted you. I don't know if I said anything, though. Thanks for coming through. Not off with Nick, with Ricky. Oh, Ricky. That cat is so darn cute. Yep. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I used to have a lot of Hulk. I don't really don't anymore. I sold, sold a lot of them. I, was, I had Hulk number one. Dang, dude. That was, yeah, that was one of my reg big time regrets. My old X Men collection had pretty much 100 through 300. Um, in Invincible I had the entire 144 issue run. Um, Hulk, I had about four or five issues, maybe in the top 20. I think I had four, four issues in the top 20, number one included. A lot of stuff that you sell whenever time gets, times get rough and, or you're getting married or just different life events. Why'd you sell? I was getting married. And then I sold the second time, uh, eight years ago, the majority of my comics again for, Medical bills. Gotcha. You're building it back up though, which is good. Your collection. Yeah. Be a lot more contained, specific on what I like. Yep. Ivy. Ivy's got some great artists right now. Ivy's one of those premier. I would say Ivy's pretty much the one of the premier books as far as artists that DC has. D uh, Poison Ivy gets all of DC's good artists on variants and stuff. Hmm. Got 10 entries, 19 people watching. Hashtag Gambit for a chance at a duck and a stack of books. 20 to 25 books. I think 25 books this month because there's what I wonder if you're days. putting together for me is making me intrigued, Trev. <laughs> Mm, what would Trev do? I don't know. I was looking for a Superman book today because I'm going to buy one to have one at least. I'm going to get one eventually. There you go. Vallejo, Jusco, and Del Otto. I saw that were cool, but I didn't know if I would like the story. Is They're the retro Supermans where it's... um, What's his buddy's name again? Friend. Oh, uh, 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 Hank... Is it uh, that dude? Is like his the dude that follows him around, or Jimmy Olsen? Jimmy Olsen. Oh, okay. So it was like um, Jimmy Olsen gets like arrested because there was like it's like Jimmy Olsen's dead, but if he's Jimmy Olsen, who am I? It's that issue. Oh, okay, cool. 
So I didn't pick it up, but if they still have it, I may pick it up. All right, see who gets the duck today. Chop. Chop. Nice chop. Congrats, chop. So far, we got Meatwad, Cliff, Tina, Frog, and Chop. Yep. And. I don't even have a short box. I can't read my. I put my comics in my drawer. Oh, you don't have too many right now. What do you have? A dozen? Uh, I'd say almost 30. Maybe 20 something. Oh, okay, Robin. You can always gift it if you win. Yeah. That's <laughs> what I did. Did you get those comics yet, Robin? Or is it still in the ether? What comics is she getting? Oh, uh, she won my prize last month. Nice. So like 20, 20 something comics. But it's going to Canada, so it takes a little while. It does. Who knows what customs is going to do? Thank right? you, Katie. Yeah, it's a small one, but it's a good one. All right, tell me when to stop. Stop. Front or back or both? Both. Tell me when to stop. Stop. Front or back or both? Front. Tell me when to stop. Stop. Front or back or both? Back. And tell me when to stop. Stop. Front or back? Front. All right. Are those just boxes of comics you're trying to get rid of and your uh, your main ones are somewhere else? Uh, yeah. Whenever I go and get like dollar books or I got those fifty dollar short boxes, so they're like thirty three cents a book. I always throw in number ones, covers that look cool that I think people would like, stuff like that to add to the box as well. Plus, it's got yeah books that I got mystery boxes and stuff that just don't fit my collection. Yep. A little mixture. <laughs> Who came in? What's up, Kevin? Entropy. Entropy. Thanks for coming through. Just watched his video pretty recently. He does a live stream. He did one last night. It was last night, right? I think it was last yeah. night. Um, goes over books he's reading in detail and books he's most anticipated. Are you and, are you and Mike uh, mm -hmm. leaving Sunday night for Heroes like after the show? Or are you guys going to do like an episode and then head out Monday morning? No, like, I'm no, I'm no. going to Heroes on Thursday. So you're getting going down there Friday morning, and then I'll be there till Monday morning and flying out. So you'll do a show from Heroes, or just no? No, show probably there? not. Probably not. You're getting so you're flying down Thursday. Yeah. Nice. Shouldn't be a long, too long flight. Maybe three hours. Yeah. Thursday or Friday morning, one of the two. We'll see. Are you guys know, getting there around there at the same time? Yeah, that's the plan at least. It doesn't give you like gives you anticipated arrival times, but it's you yeah, know, that's not definite. Exactly. Miss anybody upside down. What's up, Joe? Specs appeal. Thanks for coming through, Joe. Hey, Appreciate Specs. You. Uh oh, that's not good. Kmart, yes. Most anticipated reads tomorrow. Kevin's most anticipated reads tomorrow, right? I believe that's what it stands for. Pretty cool though. Yeah, Mike will be there Thursday and Tuesday. <laughs> You're gonna be there. We don't have a room Thursday night. Dang. Or Monday night. <laughs> Damn, Mike. Mike's like, I'll just sleep on the street. He'll sleep on the hopefully, floor. Hopefully you find a man. Yeah, if I had my own place, I'd offer a room. Ooh. 
right? I can't wait. I'm not yeah. even really there for much. Except, I mean, I want to get some stuff signed, but really have no agenda. Of course, I'm going to have money to spend, but I guess I need to figure out a couple of grails maybe to get a couple of big books, but just there for the people. Oh, yeah. Maritza. What's going on, Maritza's Yard and Crafts? Thanks Maritza. for coming in. Hey, what's up, Justin? Can you hear me okay? My mic yeah. working. Yeah. Hey, what's up, Justin? <laughs> hey. How are you doing? Just working? Yes. Always working. <laughs> always working. It doesn't look like you're working. You're on Trev's stream. Kidding. <laughs> Might as well, I guess, since you're there doing it anyway. I'll be back. Mikey reading the book soon. Yeah, we're reading the Dark Tower right now. The Tower. The Tower. Yeah, Which book I, are I you have on? no energy to scream at the cool. next one. Wizard Glass. I think that's the last one I've read. I read the first half of it. I wasn't too impressed by it. <laughs> it's probably my least favorite half of a book. Of so what? Long. The Dark Tower? Yeah. Just because it was so, like a romance, like a Western romance, pretty much. The first half of it. it it's it? all running together for me. <laughs> so it's like his backstory was Susan falling in love with Susan whenever he was a, a kid, just becoming so, a gunslinger. I, I read the graphic novel of that before I read the novel. Mm. So I don't know if that's why I was just like, like just cruising through that part because I had already read it with pictures beforehand. Mm -hmm. But I can see what you're you're saying. Uh oh, lost fogs. Got a room already booked. Extra night at a different hotel. All right, good. Man, you having problems? No, I don't know what okay. the heck happened. It's when I shut off my camera. Sometimes it cuts it in half. Yeah, I do, Kyle. Yeah, I have a part I may give Trev in person eventually. The good Kelsey. Hey, tr hey, Jason's pretty good, too. <laughs> Someone no. tried to tell me Jason was overrated as hell. Oh, no. Jason Kelsey's awesome. Jason Kelsey's the one that drives their podcast. He's definitely the the more oh, yeah. personality. Tra uh, Trev, did you see they released a Mad cover with Kelsey and uh, Swift? Oh, I forgot to show these. This is what I pulled out. We got Bounty Hunters, Kyle O'Rin cover. Yeah, I was like, Trev's got to pick that up. It's like Mad TV, the cover of um, Oh, yeah. Kelsey and I Swift. saw that. Blade, nice. Takes one to kill one. Blade, number one. Got the all new Inhumans number one. Got some Spider Gwen. Is this the chaos. one I picked from your box? Yes. Oh, I love that. Spider Gwen versus White Fox, I think is her name. I want that. <laughs> and Batman Max. That Sam Keith craziness. What the heck is that thing? It's the Max. Oh, the Max. You never heard of the Max before? Nope. He's a 90s character. A, and maybe your, life, maybe your life is the same now that you have heard of him, correct? <laughs> like you're, My point being is you're perfectly fine if you've never heard of the Max. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Damn. Uh, Reads easy the first time, but you 
Yeah, I mean, it's just all new characters. Like, he just throws so, so many new characters at you. It's kind of a lot to absorb, and it's not a lot of action or anything, so it's just a lot of story. Yep. That's the two negatives. Are, are we allowed to talk spoilers for the book? No, I'm reading it okay. the first time. I don't want no spoilers. Well, no, no, this is like the... This is for book two i think or maybe it's book three yeah we've already read that so is there a part where they're running through a city yeah okay book i thought three. that was cool yeah no book three is my favorite so far You know what movie I you know, want to see, but it seems too long, is... I don't know if it's a real book, but it's called The Book of Eli. That's a good movie. Is oh, it yeah. really? It sounds good. Yeah, uh, probably one of the best sci-fi twist endings ever. Yeah, we were talking to... Uh, me and Mike were just talking about that backstage on Sunday. It's one of my favorite oh, really? Denzel, Denzel movies. Yeah, you know what's it, a good thing? Have you guys seen Unstoppable, where they have to stop the train? No. Mm -hmm. That was a pretty good one from Denzel. Yeah, their podcast is... I think their podcast is number one podcast in the world. Dude, I wish they were allowed on ESPN, but they curse so much they couldn't. Yeah. Oh, for sure. If, if Pat McAfee can change, I'm sure they can too. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know about that. I'd love it. Yeah, Pat McAfee's is pretty big too. Dude, I love. Uh, I know someone who hates him, and I'm like, dude, I wake up whenever I'm not working. I wake up at eleven something, and then I put on McAfee at twelve Eastern, just to listen to it. So I, I feel like I have to like him because you know he's he's from Pittsburgh. That's only like an hour away. He played for. West Virginia University, which if you live in West Virginia, it's a rule you have to root for them. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I feel obligated to, to like him. Well, he's fun. What's up, Michael Baker? Michael Baker. Yeah, Spider Gwen cover is pretty sweet. But your Gwen covers are sick. I have, I just showed two off a few minutes ago. No, then yes, Gosh. book three. Action story, action. Yes, yes, you told me, yes. That's what he does with his books. One book's action, the next one's story. Right, Specs. We're just talking about anything. You don't got to be a nerd to be here. Wellbore, what's up, Canadian brother? What's up, Wellbore? What was Steve doing? I saw Steve was in here a little bit ago. Was he at the He's LCS? in his LCS getting his books. He's going home, going to do a short video, and then jump on and show us his haul. If he's... I wonder what he got. Does in time. He gets a lot of indie books. Uh, Love romance. Just don't get indie. And Tina's like, Mike, it's going to happen. One of these days, Mike. Let's go to the library. She'll be yeah, there. the McAfee show is great. The program, I should say. Okay. Mm. Oh yeah, Tina's always uplifting. Oh yeah, positivity. Oh yeah. All right. Back to board knees. We get through some of these. Trevor, tell me the truth. Are you going to pull a Paul and send me all Batman? Because I collect other stuff than Batman. I collect Spider Gwen a little bit. Don't pull. I'll get Paul. with you before I send it. Don't put. Don't pull. Gosh, dang, this wheel keeps on hitting my room. Dude, that show with last night was so much fun. Yeah, it was a blast. Dude, how I was like, Paul, can I cuss? Paul, can I please cuss? <laughs> this is in my, my new hall. 
I got this for nice. 15 bucks, 8.0. Nice. First Jubilee. Showed earlier. And then these are all dollar books. It's a 283. Fish nice. Up. Nice. 250. Wow, nice. I think this this may be the second Deadpool. It is. Two. What's the first Deadpool? New Mutants number ninety eight. I bet that's crazy expensive. Yeah. Got a little wedding cover. Who is that? Colossus and Kitty Pride, I think. They got married. Maybe. No, they did I'm just not. Going up. I'm just going off on the hands. So. It, can I spell it? It's old. Yeah. So I think it was a whole big bait and switch. Like they made it seem like Colossus and Kitty were going to get married, but um, in the end, it ended up being Rogue and Gambit. Nice. If okay. I remember, if I remember correctly. Oh, green. What's up, Larry? You know, what's Tina correct about? Here we go. Don't settle. The perfect match is out there. There you go. Durs. One of Durs. Uh, it sucks. I'm missing second straight Sunday of Sunday sesh. Changing buses. Oh, Am he I takes the bus to work and stuff. Oh, yeah. I know quite a few people that do that. Having a car is a lot of maintenance. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I'm showing off the books I got this week. Dollar books. I thought this is pretty good, pretty cool art. It's like a, you know, like old school almost. Yeah. Phantom X Max line number one. This is badass. One hundred page giant Halloween Swamp Thing. Dude, that's sick. 100 pages is a lot of a lot of comic. Undiscovered Country. Heard good things about this series. Hmm. I, think it, I think it kind of goes along the same lines as that movie that's out right now, Civil War. We got Vampire the Masquerade. If anybody's played this RPG, it's a hell of an RPG. I actually lettered that book. Did you really? Yeah. That's awesome. Hell yeah. Nice. And Firepower number one. That's cool. good things about that book. Yeah, I don't know when I'm picking up books next, probably in the next few weeks again. Tina loves it. Swampy, one of her favorites. Swampy. Couldn't resist stealing a whole wedding. Yeah. <laughs> Wonder what they're gonna do. They got they got to bring him back. Did they kill him off? Yeah, just killed him in the last episode of X Men ninety seven. That's stupid. It's, it's pretty impactful. Right. I mean, he wasn't the only one that died. A lot of people died. But the the Watcher people were saying the Watcher was up there watching them in the sky. Maybe it's a what if some kind of what if thing that happens. Gary's like, no, Mike, you're on the wrong bus. <laughs> Driving home now, lurking. Awesome. She's an Aussie. You found her at the hospital. Are you sick? She's taking care of you. You're like, come home with me. Come home with me. <laughs> <laughs> she said, hi, lurker. Mm. Goku, come on, man. Uh, everybody watch Fallout? Anybody in the chat end up watching Fallout? I haven't watched it yet. It's on my list of things to do. Very good. How long ago did Steve leave? 
I don't know. He just popped back in the chat, so he's probably home now. Happy new comic day. Yeah, I may Robert go says, in like, Holler, huh? I may go in like 25, 30 minutes. Give me a power nap. Yeah. I'm not looking forward to working out. A third day not smoking it was rough last night. Mm. But it is what it is. Yeah. Baja 500. Is that a, a, a dirt bike maybe? or Sounds like a race. Walter Groggins, yes. Dude, I loved him in... Um, where did I fall in love with him? Um, Justified with Timothy Oliphant. Walter Groggins was the bad guy. That was a good series. Oh, yes. I know. It's rough starting out, but... I'll get through it. Thank you, Robin. Appreciate that. <laughs> Stay positive, cat fans. Stay positive. The show gave me an itch to play video games. I was trying to stay strong and do things I should do one day at a time. <laughs> Talk about Fallout. <laughs> Pretty cool. The only thing, I mean, I don't know anything about the games, but the big... I don't either. All I know is the theme song. Was, wasn't was it The Wanderer? I don't know. Where's that? I know it had a bunch of awesome music for sure. Classic music. I don't know what the theme song is, though. I'm trying not to jump down the figure rabbit hole. I've been seeing people get some figures I really like. Which ones? Anime, Naruto, and Demon Slayer. Who was it? Um, oh God, someone on our, a stream I was on with. Um, oh, it was Hack. You know what Hack has, Trev? is a really cool Superman figure that we a were statue. like... statue... <laughs> I've already contacted him. I think he wants like 175 or 200 for it, but it's it's a Jim Lee Superman statue. Dang. It's it's pretty sweet for sure. He's I'll selling honest. it. What's up, Yoda? Vintage cards. Thanks for coming through. Yeah, positive cat fan, positive energy. What the shit? Thor Marvel Legends, cool. Oh, nice. Yeah, I can't wait till the new episodes come out. At least they got through. I mean, the Thousand Year Blood War is the Kenpachi arc. It's whenever he shines. So, really awesome to see that last battle with uh, what's his nuts. Um, oh God, I forgot his name. Beatwad. Yeah, they've been out for a while, haven't they? I spent way too many hours in the wasteland. The show was great. Love letter. Nice. Yeah. Grimmy, thank you very much. Thank you very much. The baddest villain. I mean, it, to have a power that anything you imagine happens, it's basically unbeatable. But he gets beat. What's up, David? Callie and Jordan squad. Thanks for coming through, David. Hope you're having a great day. Anybody watch any movies lately? Just got my tickets for Sunday for the Ministry of Gentlemanly Warfare. 
It was pretty interesting, really action packed. Henry Cavill, I've watched anything with him. My favorite actor. I think he became my favorite actor whenever he was in The Immortals. Well, I gotta run. My wife is calling me. All right, man. Appreciate Sorry. you. No, you're all good. Thanks for stopping by. Yep. I'll see you guys later. Later. Hey, there's Steve. Hey, just hey, I'm back. Oh. He's back. I'm back. Did you shoot your video already? No, I haven't. I still oh, got everything in the everything still in the bag. I haven't even taken it out yet. <laughs> I ran down to the basement to uh, find the Jeff Farragay uh, Farragay books. This is the stuff I was talking about. These are the um, uh, variant covers that came out a few years ago. And it That's was all to do with the indigenous, right? Mm -hmm. So, because I'm I'm half Ojibwa. Oh, my really? Dad, my dad's Ojibwa. My dad was Ojibwa. Very cool. Very cool. And they came out with all the ones like Thor. Yeah, that's awesome. I know. I got as a Wonder as, Woman like that. As soon as I saw these, I said, "Yeah, I got to have them all." Wait, wait! I want to see what Steve has. Hello, Steve. Hey. Up. Big fan, big fan of yours. Um, There's the Iron Man. Ooh. Thor. So what? What did I miss? Ooh. What is that? Thor. These are the variants by Jeff Varigay. He just passed away from lupus not too long ago. He's battling with lupus, and it just kicked the shit right if out of him. You don't mind me asking, not to sound dumb. What is the lupus? It's a like a wasting disease. God, His wife's left so with like $3 million <laughs> in freaking hospital debt, $3.7 million. That's and he terrible. was in there for a year with his body just basically shutting down. What's his name? Jeff Farragay. That's so sad. And he did this, uh, he, do, he did all Ooh, this freaking phenomenal art. So this is Cap. I mean, look yeah, at that. Shield. That, was called, that shield is too big for him. So I'm gonna put this stuff up on my wall for a little while. Nice. What else we got? We got. Yeah, meat wall. That that applies to pretty much all anime. Black cat. Dude. Dang. Or black uh, black widow. Sorry. Man, she got a a badunk -a dunk. Just a little bit of a badunk. <laughs> Spider Man. Those are so <laughs> cool. I like these. Right. Yeah. Wait till I get the Hulk. It's like pop art almost. How many are there in the series? Uh, a bunch. I got them all here. So there's that one. I think that's um, Hawkeye, the daughter. Looks like it. Hawk girl. Or, or whatever. No, actually, that looks like uh, the the X Men with the bow. Is it? What was your name? Oh, it might be. Oh crap! Oh yeah, I wrote on the back, but the book is. It's uh, oh, this just says Indigenous Voices number one. So that might not be anything. That might just be one of his interpretations of somebody. So it might not even be a character. That's a variant of the A cover. We got Black Panther. That <laughs> That's from awesome. Avengers 38. Yeah, I'll put them all in the back. Yeah, great covers. And then the last one is the Hulk. This one came out of uh, Immortal Hulk number 40. So, yeah, they were doing these a couple of years ago. He was doing all these indigenous covers, and I said, oh, yeah, man, I got to have all that. Because that's, that's just awesome. cool. Fucking glare. Ah, oh, glare. There we go. Look, no glare. Yeah. Hulk smash. Like, look, at, look at the pecs on him, eh? <laughs> look at the eyebrows. It's like cat, cat's, eyes, uh, cat's eyes pecs on him. Bam! <laughs> yeah, it's like his, his pecs or eyes. It look, almost looks like, what character is that? Maybe from He-Man? <laughs> yeah, something like that. Yeah, you're right. It kind of looks like one of those square-like characters. But, man, just amazing artwork. And it's too bad. Interesting, AR. So he's not playing that guy, but that guy was actually in the ministry? Huh. I don't know anything about it. Yep, so that's my thing there. Now I got to do like you. I got to sit here and bag and board all my 
My all haul. the new ones. All What'd new you ones. get? Plus all the uh, the ones that I got for free. Oh, shitty. I think he mixed them all in. I got this Definitely one here. That's unique cool. colors, Tina. The forged. Ooh. That one looks pretty interesting whenever I saw that come out initially. Yeah, it's a good story. But yeah, so this one's all messed up. The corners are all destroyed and everything on it. But again, price was right. Three. I mean, it's usually yeah. like 10 bucks for that book because of that prestige format, right? I was still under 100 bucks, though, uh, so that's good. Thanks. Thanks, David. Appreciate it. <laughs> you said it looks like bones. No. <laughs> your your face is on Hulk's chest. No, rather not be. <laughs> you do have green on right now. I do. Hulk smash. Yeah, I didn't get a bag and board for this one though. Hopefully, I got an extra one kicking around for this uh, prestige format. Yeah, I'm always apprehensive buying those just because of having to buy a whole deal of bags and boards if I keep on reading them. So everybody tells me this saga is a good book, but I've never really read it. I've got a like the one of those tribute first issues because I know the first issue is worth some money. People go crazy for it, but free. It's good. I, I thought like about free. grabbing. They have the entire trade paperback. Like there's like 15 trade paperbacks. You know. Yeah. Like volumes, and they have every single one in the five dollar bin at LCS. I'll wait till they drop them, and then uh, when they're all dented and shit, then I'll get them for nothing. So I, I thought about picking it up at one point because, yeah, everybody says Sog is good. So that's all Some my free ones. Killers. What did I get today? Sam and Twitch. That's because of Dope I grabbed this one. New Mutants, not the X Men, the New Mutants. Yes, you're correct. That's who I was thinking. Moonstar from the New, new Mutants. Just because her outfit, it was that new mutant style. Hello. <laughs> Somebody call you? Is that why you get disconnected? No. Uh, how are my Yankees doing? They're losing to the Blue Jays, probably. That's why you're saying that. So shut up, David. <laughs> Cobra! Cobra! Dude, people were saying, I didn't read the last issue or, of course, this one yet, but people were saying that he, like, gets down and shows how much of a badass hand-to-hand -hand Oh, yeah, because in the cartoon, he was portrayed as such a wimp, always retreating and stuff. And this one, uh -huh. there, they were putting a drill through his kneecap, and he's just sitting there going, like, fuck you, bring it. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, holy shit. Yeah, they were saying he, like, severed his nerve ending so he didn't feel anything. Yeah, he's just sitting there letting them drill a hole through him and stuff, and he's just like, fuck you. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I, I'm liking this Cobra Commander, man. He's awesome. Okay, three is the limit on that thing. All right, good to know. Almost dead. Uh-oh. Yeah, I'm is enjoying it. pointed a dead body? Is that Logan Paul? Yes. Didn't he do that? Sure. God. He did, and it was so stupid because it was in a uh, Japanese suicide force. Yeah. Ryan Benjamin. Is that the same? Yeah, same cobra I got. Picked up the agent. I like this one. It's been a good series. Ooh, that looks cool. Yeah, some new books out this week. This one called Blow Away. It's on Key Collector app. I usually go on Key Collector app and see what's uh, the latest and greatest cool stuff out. So uh -huh. I thought I'd give it a try. My LCS is doing awesome. They haven't, uh, pretty much every book that I've wanted that wasn't on my re regular poll list, they've hooked me up. So that's been fantastic. I hope yes, cigarettes, my cigarettes. I hope I'm not uh, working on free comic book day, but I don't know my schedule yet. I'm telling you, dude, you, it doesn't matter really. You can go after the fact and they'll have some. True. What's up, Birdman? Kenny Bird Bird? Man. Kenny. What's up, Carmen? Carmen my Strax? last name actually means bird. That's the funny thing. Really? Just the cover. Was it, uh, is it Vogel? Vogel, is that your last name? Vogel yep. Heck yeah. 
Christina's still here. What's up, oh, Christina? Chris yeah, I need... Cool. Chaney! Dude, hey, Chaney, man. he's been showing up a lot lately. You did, had a lot of good input on the Dark Tower. That was... Oh, yeah. Really, really happy you stopped by. That's one of our Dynasty Breaks customers. That's cool. Man, he was he had read the Dark Tower and he was he had some some really good input in that stream. I know he needs to jump on. We gotta get Mike to jump get him to jump on. That'd be freaking right? awesome. This court cover is just wicked. Like some of the horror covers they're what coming the out heck? with are freaking awesome. Talk to He's John got his Carpenter's brain talk to commandos. Oh yeah. Yeah. He looks some creepy ass shit, man. <laughs> You guys aren't reading Displaced. You got to pick this up, man. That's a freaking awesome book. Ed Brisson, my Canadian brother from mm -hmm. Oshawa. Freaking cool story. Picked that one up and I got the B, the B cover of that too. B cover is pretty wicked. I can't wait to see where this story is going to go now. It's only five issues, so we're on three now. So two more to go and we'll see how this thing wraps up. The city of nice. Oshawa has disappeared. Uh oh. It doesn't exist anymore. Nobody remembers it. Like the lost city of Atlantis. Ooh. Yeah, it's kind of it's a it's a freaky ass story. It's really good. It's well written. And the best part that, that that's freaking me out is like all the scenes and stuff they're showing in here are like my town that I live in right now. So I'm seeing like landmarks and buildings and places that oh, I nice. go to every single day are in the comic book, man. So it's it's freaking cool, man. <laughs> that's really cool. Wow. Especially a place, there's a, a place called the Shoppers Drug Mart. It's a, uh, they got a post office in there that I pick up all my books and shit. And that's in one of the books too. It's in the first one. Nice. I, Trevin, Trevin and I are in a comic book. That's cool. Yeah. We're in the crowd. You're in, in the uh, crowd? One of which Marvin is, wins. Which book is that? Trevin, do you have it near you? I'm too late uh, to get it. Yeah, let me grab it real quick. I'll just keep putting books up. My Hellblazer. Nice. Yeah, this Dead in America. I've been enjoying this series. It's been good. But anything John Constantine, I'm just a big fan of. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Tom King's killing it. Freaking Wonder Woman, man. Fantastic. DC nice. goodness, baby. DC goodness. Yep. Not too much in the Marvel today. Only four books. Picked up the giant size Hulk. Nice. Uh, I can't oh, find it. Let's you can't find goes. it. Don't worry about mm -hmm. it. We'll take, I'll take your word it. for it. You guys are in a book. I got to get that the, book it's now. It's the edge. Not the Marvel edge. Win. The okay. edge. Yeah. I got to find it now. Oh, I'll get. It. I could probably. I probably have another copy. I could send to Steve. Right? If you're in Oshawa, I'm 45 minutes away. Says Callie and Jordan Squad. Yeah, there you go. I'm in Whitby actually, but Oshawa is where my LCS is, and that's where the display story takes place. Ed Brisson, he's a Osh. He's a, he's a former Schwa man himself. I used to live in the Schwiggity Schwa, but not a anymore. Schwa man. The Schwa. That's what we call Oshawa Schwa. Got me some Spider Man. Nice. Little Miles and Peter hanging out. And their collaboration going on. I forget how many years older than Peter is than Miles. Isn't it like quite a bit? Yeah, well, it, I don't know. Because Peter Parker really doesn't grow up. So I don't know how old he is compared to Miles. And Miles is from an alternate uh, universe or alternate Earth. And that whole universe got destroyed and only two of them escaped. It was him and some other, some villain guy that got away. You're in yeah. Vietnam, Kyle? Dang. Wow. That's cool. You're getting them from all over the world there, Trev. I thought you were in Canada. Are you visiting? Or not Canada, California. Please tell me you did not talk about the dirty schwa. I talked about the dirty schwa. Uh, that's funny. That's okay. I lived in the dirty schwa for quite a few years. My teenagehood was wandering the dirty schwa. 
Everybody's got a town like that everywhere. It doesn't matter anywhere oh, on the planet. Cliff Everybody's wants... got that one town. Yeah, Look who's just... in the chat. I feel like Cliff's definitely going to want to jump in. Cliff? Oh, yeah. He's jumping on. And hopefully he's at his LCS again, too. So we we'll represent two of them. That's right. Robin's also in Canada. And I think Biz is in Canada. Are you Jesus, in Canada? Yes, you, got, you got everybody from north of the wall here, man. Right? There's Cliff. Yeah, Wonder Woman is amazing right now. It's, it's oh, crazy, yeah, yeah. crazy good. One of the best books for sure. Tom King, man. What's Tom up, King. Cliff? Yep. the The last issue was kind of filler. Yeah, it was like the whole birthday thing. I was like, I was reading it, going, "What the hell is this?" Yeah. And I was but, like, "Okay, I'll keep going because I know he'll get back to whatever the hell he's doing." Everybody's got to have that one book where they're, you know, it's a gimme. It's almost like he re he wrote it on like really fast, or he had already had it written and just kind of threw it in there. Mm -hmm. That is like I want to take a little two week vacation. They're like, all right, just get this pumped out in two weeks. Exactly, <laughs> kind of like what I do with videos. So I got a whole bunch in the bank, so I can just toss one up if you know whenever. Mm -hmm. What's up, Cliff? Hope you're having a good one. All right, so that's it for me. Oh, com Comic Aussie is in Toronto. Holy shit, right on. What the hell? What's going God on damn. here? We're going to all have to hook up at some point in time, man. Right? You guys can have your own little heroes calling up there. Well, yeah, when we all go to Fan Expo together and we all find each other and have ourselves a... Uh, I, I might even go live during that, too. That's because the reception in there is pretty good. That Fan Expo Toronto? Yeah, the one in August. I bet that one's massive. Oh, it is freaking insane. I'm always glad that I get the the ultimate fan pass because then I get in two early two hours early on Thursday, so we get to look around and get the lay of the land, and are we have priority entrance. On are you allowed to buy on Thursdays if you get in early? Oh yeah! Oh shit! Yeah, yeah. What's up, Bud Files? Yeah, you Bud can get Files. in and get digging right away. Cliffy, what are you doing? Hop on. Wow, uh, sweet! I'm uh, used to you guys. Canadian survivalist said he'll be at Expo. All oh, right, on. You're gonna have to find us, man. Like uh, um, Mark and I will be there wandering around. We if hang you're out. Oslo, we... You're only 30 hours from New Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> Not a problem. Yeah. Just start now. You'll get here by August. That's funny. One of our dragons take... will let you through the wall. You just take the Oregon Trail up. That's right. We got <laughs> we got those uh, little tunnels that go under the wall that you can get through with the freaking portcullis on them. <laughs> we got a couple of yetis that'll pick it up for you get you a timmy timmy double double and some tim timmy, timmy. that tim hortons yeah tim hortons I heard Coffee shop up stuff. Here. never seen one of those places yep when did you ever believe me what you're a wealth of knowledge cliff. <laughs> come on cliff i'm too far in ottawa Ottawa. Callie, will, she'll be in in in, in Whitby tomorrow, right wow. on. Yep, I'm a Whitby boy. That's where I am now. I escaped from the spaghetti. That was my birthday. You were watching the Senators. Nice, nice. Yeah. So well, bored. Glad to see you're still here. For work. Yeah, they got Canadian survivalists. <laughs> Dude, this is kind of... We got 21 people in here. Guaranteed half of y'all are Canadian. <laughs> yeah, weather's still pretty miserable. It was colder today. My lawn's getting up there. I might actually have to mow it this weekend. Like, Jesus, got to get my, my battery charged up on the lawnmower. Do you guys have pretty short summers up there? Or just no, mild? no, it'll, it'll go from like... April, May, you know, all the way into freaking sometimes November. Mm -hmm. I think we'll get some nice hot weather in there. December is really when winter starts now. So we get a pretty good time. This winter, we didn't have nothing. Holy crap. This is probably the nicest winter I've ever seen. Maybe two or three days of snow. I I, I only used my snowblower once. Wow. And yeah, I didn't, didn't even have really the, need... the snow tires on there very long. No, no. Summers are on there, baby. <laughs> Those bald ass 315s that I got to change. <laughs> it was squirrely today. It was raining and cold. 
car was sliding around a little bit going to the Schwiggity to get my books. <laughs> but I held her together. And then, of course, gas is going to jump like 14 cents. So every maniac yeah. in the world was hitting the gas station. So I had to freaking wedge the car in there and get some gas before I came back. And, of course, she's almost empty and the light's on, dinging at me, yelling at me. I'm yelling back at it, going, I fucking know already. <laughs> I'm going to get you some go-go juice. Just give me a minute, all right? Sort, I'll sort myself out. <laughs> <laughs> holy shit have fun there larry first con he's going to in august st jose oh Colony. man i'm tired i said i was gonna leave but i'm just gonna show off my camera Wait. fan expo edmonton yeah but i think i'm working that weekend yeah i think it's the same one it just rolls across canada c2e2 oh. i know a lot of people that are going to c2e2 oh man year. i'd love to hit that one what's like c2e2 then it's the white walkers we're being invaded. invaded. <laughs> White walkers. All right. Got I saw that one. Look up in the sky. It's That's a drive awesome back, man. Where's Chris Bigger, man? DC oh, goodness, man. I didn't even change that that one. <laughs> what the bags shit? Yeah, these are I mean, these are 2003, I think. So oh, it's been God, on yeah. since 2003. And they're just they're 23, cloudy. 20 years in the bag. Yikes. Mm -hmm. Well, it's not as bad as my 80s ones that were like 40 years in the bag. <laughs> Holy crap. And some of them were so freaking like discolored and shit. You could barely see the book inside until you pull it out. <laughs> and then all of a sudden those colors start popping. You're like, dang, this looks better than I thought it did. Yeah, because well, I just pulled a part of the ink off, so now she's got <laughs> fresh ink underneath. So it looks great. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I got a layer off on the back and board too. Nice. Oh, some Wonder Woman action. Is that the same yeah. book with a different cover? Uh, this is number ten. Oh, okay. Last one was number nine. Michael Turner. He does the oh. variants on these. This is my favorite Jim Lee cover. Oh shit! Yeah. That's Went it. Dark That's side true. made a clone army of doomsdays. Says so a Batman got a sword in his hand there. Yeah, cool. they're on Themyscira, so Wonder Woman throws him a couple swords. Nice. Oh yeah, That's wicked. Some Dark Side in the background. Mm -hmm. Is that when Superman had been turned by the uh, uh, the undeath equation there, whatever it was? Uh, I don't think that happens in the book. I don't, I don't that was like that dark happened. dark knight's death metal yeah that's cool they really got to bring dark side in and make him more of a badass funny thing is it's always seems like it's always batman that's beating dark side you know he's like outsmarting him out, yeah exactly that's, that's the cool. start of the new run the new arc well amazon action Hell yeah. An extra just put my summers today. Oh, he just put his summer tires on today too. Aussie. Nice. Ooh. Yeah, so many nice Canadians, eh? That's yeah. right, eh? Good day, eh? Yeah, I'm not looking forward to our summer because the winter was so quick. Our summers down here are brutal. Oh, Ours frig, yeah. It's going to be hot too. It was 87 the other day. It is 92 today. You guys are going to roast. Thank God for air conditioning. Just yeah. need Rush Die Hard to pop on. Yep. Yep. Holy crap. I only got two image books this week. Yeah. Treb is big in Canada like Hasselhoff is big in Germany. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. <laughs> I uh, love that. Thanks, boy. Texas representing in Canada. <laughs> Get on there, put on my leather jacket, and pump out a few singles. That's right. It's better to be dead and cool than alive and uncool. <laughs> melted. Snow is melting now. It's all about a boot us, eh? A boot, a boot us. Have you guys seen the Family Guy clip where it's um, Brian and Stewie and Brian's Prius like stops working and they're on the way to North Pole? 
And so they're in Canada and then they call AAA and he's like, um, he's like, or no, he gets a hitchhiker. He's like, hey man, can you help us? He's like, hey man, why don't you call AAA? Hey, 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 hey. And he's like, <laughs> he's like, what did you say? He's like, AAA. Triple A. Triple A. What's up, DJ? James. What's up? Hi, James. So, I wasn't trying, I mean, I was trying to join, but I wasn't trying to join yet. I was trying to chat, but it kept not letting me do comments or anything. Stop lying. Well, oh, is it that one where, like, you go to comment and then the, the whole thing just jumps on you? Yes. Um, Like, yeah. I could see everybody else's chat, but it wouldn't allow me to do a comment. For some reason, yeah. there was no, like, bar. Yeah, I think, to me before. I think that's what Tina was experiencing last night. I had to exit out and then join back in, and then it works sometimes. Huh. That weird yeah, I closed the video a couple times, but so I figure I'm already leaving, so I might as well try to join for a couple minutes. <laughs> yeah, I forgot y'all. So how are y'all doing? Tired, tired, but good. I can agree to that. Trev has become a Canadian icon. Vote for Trev. It was our Trump day, so <laughs> that was fun. That's Prime Minister. That That's our uh, version of a president. A. Who who was the crazy one who took drugs a few years ago? Oh, you're talking about the mayor of Toronto. That was Doug Ford. Yeah, he was all oh. over the freaking news all over the world because of all the ridiculous shit talking oh, about doing crack and stuff. Oh, yeah. Bob James. I thought you said you had gas, not you had to go get gas. My bad. Nope. I had to get fuel for the car because the car is thirsty and she likes fuel. My car runs on dinosaurs. <laughs> not on that. Uh, sun, car runs on the, those the premium, sun rays. You put things. the premium, premium, don't you? 91 octane. I don't put horse. Oh, you put the mid in car. I put a little yeah. horse in there. Yeah, I don't need to go 93 or higher because then, you know, it's got to change. The computer will change the fuel ratio, but the owner's manual says 91 is fine. Just I can't put like 89 or anything lower in it because it doesn't like that at all. Get you very angry at me. Yay me. There you go. <laughs> hey, you're back. You're back. Did you, get Did you pay your internet? Today? There we go. No, it's connected to my car when I'm connected to my earpiece. There you go. Yep, Brad's in. Sorry there. about that. Brad was putting Christmas carols on his IG account today. It was hilarious. Oh, wow. He had all no one is in his lawn, and he was doing Christmas carols. I said, "Yeah, get, get the Christmas tree back up and put the lights out." <laughs> <laughs> That's mess funny. up the neighbors. <laughs> Man, it'd be time be flying really fast if that was already here. Yeah, I was like, we're not even in Christmas in July yet. <laughs> Trev, I told DJ, I was like, man, you need to get some Batman comics soon. He was like, I'm bad. Some Batman comics? Oh, yeah. That's his dude, too. Who, um, me? You? Him? What? You. Well, I mean, I have the graphic novels. I have the Deadly Duo that I just completed finally. So maybe each time I'm, if we're able to go to, into town to the, my LCS, then maybe I'll pick up one or two here and there. 93. Jesus, what are you driving, Ozzy? Well, yeah, my, my last Camaro, I used 93. My parents just let me know that uh, the car parts are expensive, so I'm getting a new car. I'm going to miss my car. Yeah. Yeah. I'm getting a new car here pretty soon. Probably the oh, beginning. Yeah. Next, what next you year. getting? You get something. I haven't good. decided yet. I, I had a Volkswagen yet. Passat. I'm probably going to get something something equal look at it like uh, three to five years old yeah um, sports car because I've, I've always owned a sports car until my last car that i own right now, right now i've owned four camaros and a mustang excellent oh, wow. See? life's too short to drive boring cars trev yeah. gets it trev gets it you guys should get it too yeah, sure. <laughs> Because these modern cars, man, they get great gas mileage. Like my, my Challenger, man, that thing gets amazing gas mileage. I went to the uh, Woodward Dream Cruise in Detroit, and I drove all the way back to Whitby, which is like four hours and change on a single tank of gas, and I still had fuel in the tank. Meanwhile, oh, wow. I have another car. It's an 05 Magnum RT with a smaller engine. I had to stop like twice 
the fella. Thank you, Christina, ah, by cool. the way, about the comment on my intro. Yeah, it's a it was a fun intro to me. Ooh, the golf R's, yeah. You get those, uh, the R for racing, just like with the uh, Civic R. Frickin' things are expensive, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm thinking about doing an outro. I, I need my friend to fill her. You know exactly what I'm gonna do. You got any aftermarket stuff? Huh? On the, on the Challenger? Oh, me? No, it's an SRT, yeah. so it's got everything now. I mean, when you buy the SRT, it already comes with all the cool shit. So the only thing I threw on it was a catch can because the 392s, they got an oil problem on the top end. Happened with the 5.7s, too. They get oil into the uh, throttle body, and mm -hmm. it would start throwing codes and acting up. So I put a, a catch can on there. That's, that's about it. And then it's just bling. So I just put some lights in the front end to make it look all pretty when I'm at a car show. <laughs> nice. Not the lights underneath the car, just the ones around the headlights and shit, because, you know, and under the engine. Just just stuff like that, you know, little dumb things. My other cars, you know, I'd have to start putting performance parts on it. And then I got the Demon reps with the 20-inch with the 10 and a half on the back so I could put the fat tires. The fat boys. The P-H-A-T. Fat tires. P-H-A-T. Because it's more fun to slide around on those than the 275s. It, it, it grips quite a bit better. Yeah. Well, the Contis are good, but mine, are, they're bald now, so I got the cheapo ones to replace. We'll see how they are. <laughs> 200 yeah, bucks those, even the, Yeah, even the cheapo ones are still pricey. Yeah, well, that, that's not bad because the, the Contis, the four, all four <laughs> cost me 1000 and they were used. So now I got the rears for 400 bucks for both. So, and James, brand are new. you driving? Yeah. Yeah, I'm driving. Yeah. I'm driving home. Oh, no, he's just yeah. sitting there looking. Yeah, I have, I have my uh, phone screen. until I get my new uh, hit the green screen. It's frozen. <laughs> yeah, I have my phone down on my on my little mount down here until I get another uh, socket to go up on my uh, mount up top. It's down right below me, next to the the shift the gear shift. That's cool, green machine. So you're saving a buck to two dollars a gallon. Frick yeah. I love I love oh, wow. gassing up. Once I cross that border, man, I hit the gas station and I gas up. But I like the shells because they don't have the ethanol and crap in the fuel, right? Mm -hmm. That's what I use, shell. I do up, too. Up here, the petrol cans and the SOs and all that shit, they got all that ethanol stuff and the car doesn't like that. What's the, I wonder what the con is. is isn't is Phil from Detroit area? Trev? Do what? Phil Treehouse. Uh huh. Yeah, I wonder what con he goes to because I wonder. Um, he, he's around Detroit. Is there a he's, con in Detroit? Do they have one yeah. up there? The Motor City Comic Con. Yeah. Oh shit, man! I could, I could, I could hit that one. That's only like four hours. Yeah, but, usually he and K-pop are always at that one. That's, that's like local event. Yeah, and I know people at the Windsor border there too, so I could hang overnight. <laughs> what is that? What's the Windsor border? Between um, there and uh, Detroit, that's at the border right there. That's Windsor is the city in Canada. Okay. Interesting. Just got a few of these left. Oh, we're running right up to it. Just get through these. Yeah. Holy shit, quarter to five or quarter to six already. Damn. Yeah, it's going by quick. No, uh, I gotta go work out. It's gonna suck. <laughs> I had a different kind of workout. <laughs> What's that? The our, our truck. I, we had a thousand piece truck today. Oh, okay. Yeah, for truck. retail for Walgreens, so all the boxes, all the totes, Just throwing around boxes and totes. So, different kind of workout. <laughs> the green what machine time? probably uses those sun rays, right, to fix your car up there. You don't use any gas in that, right? You got those sun rays that lightnings, lightnings into the car. Dodge <laughs> Charger is going to be a lightning car this year. 
I'm waiting until they have what they call the six pack. They're putting an inline six with a twin turbo. It's going to be like 500 and change horsepower. I remember when the did everybody Dodge... freeze? Nope, no, you froze. I, I remember when the your Dodge... lights went out. Yeah, you're in the dark. I remember when the Dodge did... Demon came out. I never found out how well it performed. Oh, I was doing really good. They wanted the front end to lift off the ground, and it was like breaking rear axles at the drag strip all the time. And if guys modified their car, Dodge would come in and say, nope, void warranty, sorry. <laughs> and now they got the 170, which is over 1,000 horsepower. What was the Demon at? Demon That's was crazy. at something crazy, wasn't it? Mm-hmm. It's expensive, my, my aunt, too. When, when my grandma died, they distributed up the the estate the first thing she bought was a demon or a hell dog or a hell, hell something the hellcat was it was it a hellcat or yeah. no a demon dog demon dog was it was it a demon dog or a demons it's called a demon something i know there's a hellcat is the one above the hellcat i think yeah no? well there there was a demon out and then now the new one is called the demon 170 yeah that's what that's what she, i mean she's been a she, Oh, I know they're Long like uh, over hundred grand for them. up here. They want like three hundred changes. Some dealerships are just gouging the shit out of people. No one's buying it. Yeah, they're just sitting on lots. But I want to say she spent like one seventy or something, like something stupid. Like, yeah, like MSRP on that's like one fifty or one forty or something like that. But the lots will just gouge you like crazy. There's a guy called Racer X. He's down down your way there, Trev, and uh -huh. he's talking about this stuff all the time. And he says that, that there's all kinds of these challengers and chargers sitting on lots down there everywhere. Nobody's buying nothing. And you can get them dirt cheap now. Yeah. Is he? Up, is yeah. Thanks for coming through, Izzy. Hope you're having a great day. Oh, are you home? Day. That was fast. Hector, what's up? Can you not see him? Who, me? having a hard time seeing him? Yeah, you engage light speed, right? <laughs> Will's like, where are you? Why is everything you so your... static and glitchy? I'm are you in your I'm car? Halfway. Obviously, he looks like he's in his in a house now. That's now he's in his house. Awake. Awake. Me? <laughs> yeah, I'm in my house. There you go. Nice. Yep, your Wi-Fi isn't working very well then, eh? What's up, Hector and Richard? Uh, I'm on mobile right now. So. Okay, yeah, it should be should you. be good. Yep, we can see you clearly, no problem. That's weird. Yeah, you seem fine. You're good. We can hear you. What's up, crazy? Thanks for popping through. Okay. You just loving Vogue's hair today? My hair's it's a kinda, mess, dude. It's kind of puffy. Hey, you got hair. Who how's said my, that? How's oh, my hair okay. look? Does my hair look Flip. good? Cliff, literally, it's a mess. I'm getting a haircut next week. <laughs> I got to get the turtle wax out. Oh, man. Look at this. So I can slide through the air much turtle faster. Wax. Bigger, faster, stronger. Oh. Yep. No drag. No, no drag force to worry about. Everything just slides. Nice. Easy. What'd you want, like, Trev? Yeah. Awesome hair. That's right, Tina. Izzy, no the comic <laughs> vet, and Brian LCS had a three-channel joint giveaway, and I won it. What'd you so win? they're each, oh, wow. they're nice. each sending me a slab. The one that Izzy sending me is a uh, Superman logo variant 9.8. Oh, and yeah, I saw that. That thing is so cool. Superman 78. Yeah, is, is, isn't it a con variant or something? Yeah, New yeah. York Comic Con variant. Yeah, <laughs> Frick, man, that is a beautiful That's awesome. Cover. Yeah, I've been pretty lucky lately. I hope to oh, get a beautiful. detective there you go. eventually. <laughs> nice hair, Steve. Nice yes. Hair. I know. Tina, Tina's all over it. The luscious locks. <laughs> of Steve, the Challenged aerodynamically. <laughs> <laughs> that's right, Richard. That's right. <laughs> that's no, a, that's how we identify ourselves as uh, focally challenged. <laughs> <laughs> Flawlessly challenged. Solidarity. It's funny. All right. Last big old stack of books. Start oh, 16. yeah. There we go. I oh, need to spend the bars and get out of there. <laughs> no, there no, no powers at that point. Power less. So Who's Ra's that Ra's Ra's next to Batman? That's, cool. Who's... That's, That's Ra's 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 right Ra's 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 That's his parents down here. Ra's Ra's and this is that's probably uh, his dad. Oh, yeah. When Kent 
Yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. Do we ever find out that. what happened? I don't remember this saga. With this Did, uh, is it arc. Superman's planet blew up, right? That's why they sent him away. Yep. Yes. Yes. Yep. They had a cataclysm that destroyed the planet, and they sent him off. That's cool. Back to that McGinnis art. I kind of like it. Some people oh, think yeah. it's kind of kind of blocky. Yeah, that's okay. It's got that 90s vibe to it. You're right. That's one. It's pretty cool. It's ba backwards and oh, upside yeah. down because it's, uh, it's Bizarro. Like Bizarro. Bizarro. The, the Batman Bizarro. Bat Zaro. Bat Zaro. He almost looked yeah. like he was wearing a tutu there for a second. Wait, I had to do a see. double take on that. I'm going, what the hell is Batman wearing? 23. Yep. Glow What's in the dark going on Batman. With Batman? Is he He's slightly Batman? irradiated? He's not charged or irradiated. Yet. That's Geiger. Geiger man. Geiger Dude, Batman. Geiger man. <laughs> Batger. Bat Geiger. <laughs> Bat Geiger. <laughs> the Geiger Bat. And the guy, yeah, of course, they go. brought in the females, the other worlds. I like that one. Yes. Rip Michael Turner. One of the greatest. <laughs> What's up, Rude? Hey, Rude. Oh. Rude. Real Fun rude. time last night hanging out with you on Paul's channel. Yep. And Vogs and DJ. It's fun time. Oh yeah, I was there. No. <laughs> what? You were there? Nice. <laughs> Grass doesn't grow on a busy road. What are you trying to say? He like rubs his head too much or <laughs> <laughs> I like to think that the, my brains had pushed all my hair out. There, yes, your brain expanded. This is yeah. actually a connecting. Oh, connecting cover. Nice. Nice. Oh, nice. I like that one. Yeah, they got the yellow. Still brought in the youngins. I like that There's one. The other world's, world's finest. I Huntress wonder why you like that one. Eh? You're looking at the cape, right? Her cape. Yeah, I don't. I don't ever. I don't ever remember Huntress's breast being that big. <laughs> well, it's like, somebody was thinking something when they were drawing that one. They're like, I can't make yeah. them too small. The next to Power Girl. You got this. Is oh uh, yeah, there you fourth, go. That's fourth key. Doomsday. Third, third printing. Holy crap! Yeah. That book was hot for a minute. Mm-hmm. Just a couple of these. Love that cover. Oh, yeah. It's like a Conan oh, nice. kind of cover. War World Saga. Conan, Star Wars, yeah. <laughs> Homage. This is a classic one. Mm -hmm. Oh, there we go. That's shiny. Cool. Shiny. That's nice. That's the Tina shiny alert. <laughs> shiny, <laughs> shiny. And I love this cover. Oh, yeah. The eyes. It almost reminds me of the dude from uh, The Boys. Yeah. yeah. Come at me and see what Home happens. Homel Homelander. Homelander. Yeah. yeah, it's got the ha ha ha's yeah. behind him. I think he might yeah. be jokerized. Oh, wasn't there there was a movie where like an evil Superman was it called Bright? Bright Burn? Bright Burn. Bright Burn. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. That was freaking cool. That yeah, was. What if Superman was a serial killer? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oops. I mean, I mean, he was just basically a kid. I mean, a kid would just leash out and if he couldn't control his powers, any kid yep. would yeah. do that. And that's basically yeah, what that's would happen if Superman was evil. Yep. What's up, Sheena? Melon in the manga. You know Melon what I manga. haven't um, read is being a Batman fan is I've never read the Flashpoint Batman series. Oh. Where isn't it Thomas Wayne and Sid Bruce? Oh, you just talking about Flashpoint in general? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, his dad. Is Batman? Yeah, his his mom is the Joker. Oh yeah, um, he he's just a normal kid, isn't he? Yeah. No, no. Well, he died. Bruce oh, yeah, Wayne died. died. Yeah. I forgot. Dude, that's no, that no, no. no. That a, never mind. Okay. That's Have not Flashpoint. That's not Flashpoint. I don't know what I'm thinking. Yeah, Flashpoint. I know. Yeah. Yeah. They were thrown onto an no. island and they had to fight it out. And they kept getting, uh, they, they had their memories blanked out and they had those uh, oh. codes in the back where you could play the I'm, game. Yeah, I'm thinking of, uh, 
Oh, gosh. I can't remember that series I'm thinking of. Yeah, I can't. Someone will know in the comments. Oh, yeah. Someone's going to correct the shit. That is here. Flashpoint. That is Flashpoint? Yeah. No, yeah. Man. Okay, okay, okay. Have you? I haven't read it. Man. I've heard it's I don't know. pretty good. Getting confused. That is his, his dad that he has to help regain his powers. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It is Flashpoint. His cousin was the Riddler. That's insane. That must be a good story then. Yeah, I remember. It's pretty good. I haven't read that in so long though. You guys got anything you want to shout out before we close for the day? Nope. Steve? All the good community. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to film my voices choices right after this and throw it up and then I've got some Friday, or yeah, Friday, yeah, Friday, sure, Friday. I'm gonna put up another video just on an unboxing <laughs> stuff I got from Arlington, Texas. <laughs> Lone Star Comics. The Lone Star Comics down there in Dallas, <laughs> Texas. You speaking funny? Yeah, <laughs> right. Where are you <laughs> from, boy? <laughs> Texas. Jeez, only steers and queers come from Texas. And you don't look hey, much like a steer to me. Remember hey. that movie? <laughs> that's I mean, that's how the movie. line goes from the movie for the show. <laughs> Metal jacket. God damn, yeah. I love that movie. What about you, James? What about me? I don't matter. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Your next um, live is next Monday? No. Um, actually... Things are changing in my life, so it looks like it's going to be this Saturday. Oh. Okay. Okay. It's going to be Saturday night, I believe, uh, 8 p.m. 8 p.m. Eastern? Or I'm going to try and do earlier, but I think it's going to be 8 p.m. for me, uh, which would be, what is it, Central Standard? You're Central now because you didn't have daylight savings? What? Central? Do they even change? Us. No. Or Mountain. I always mix those two up, Mountain and Central. We're Mountain Standard Time. Jesus. Wow. Right. My wife's always having to correct me because I can never remember. 9 um, Central, 10 Eastern. Okay. Yeah, but I'm going to try and work on the timing, but I'm going to try and do earlier. But as of right now, it might be yeah, 8 p.m. Uh, for Mountain Standard Time. Um, but I'm going to try and do earlier. Just yeah, I have a few different things that are changing around, so... Basically, I was going to be doing Mondays. I'm thinking it's going to be on one of the week weekend days. Um, but I'm going to try and do earlier, especially for, you know, the Midwest and Eastern people. You know? Cool, so, cool. Wait. And I'll be trying to okay. do Aloha Friday with Aaron. Sorry. On Friday. No, that's cool. All right. So, What um, time does he go, usually? 10 o'clock Central? 10-something Eastern. 10, 10 something ago. Eastern, 7 30, I think, for me, usually. Yeah. Because he's, Hawaii's what, I think, three hours behind me? Yeah. So. Um, but that's Friday. And I think Vlogs is going to be there, too, right? Yeah, I'll be there. Yeah. Um, For me, um, I'll be there on Friday for Aaron Aloha Friday. And if Barry Beehurst goes live, I'll go live with him tomorrow. Oh, nice. And then Saturday, we'll see. I work 2 to 10. So I may pop in for like an hour, hour and a half, maybe two hours for James's after work. <laughs> if I'm exhausted. Because who knows? You always say an hour, and then you say three hours. <laughs> Bingo. And then uh, Tuesday night, you can see me on Paul's, but I can't be on Tuesday because Tuesday I'm also working. Yeah, we both have to work, so we miss this Tuesday. Yeah, which thinks because uh, what's his name's coming back on? Oh, Patrick, yeah. Patrick, yeah. Patrick Cardi. Yeah, nice. Yep. All right, as far as my lives, Sunday night, 9 o'clock with Evil Mike, and back here next week, 3 o'clock, backing, boarding, and BS. Always open panel. Anybody can come on. Everybody's welcome. And uh, new comic book day videos, Thursday night at midnight. So check that out. Thank you so much, everybody. Have a great rest of your day and a great rest of your week. And as always, Matt Woods.